Hello everyone, welcome to Selwyn Tech Topics. Today we're going to learn how to acquire your Ontario proof of vaccination as a QR code. So we're on a PC today, so a computer, and you're gonna need a modern web browser. So Internet Explorer, Microsoft Edge, here we're gonna use Chrome. You can also use Firefox. So we'll open up Google Chrome there by double clicking that. And here we're into Google. So we're gonna type in Ontario vaccine proof. Then you click enter on your keyboard. And so that will take us, it'll give us a list of options here. So we're gonna click on, here it's the first one, the proof of COVID-19 vaccination. So we'll click on that link there. This will bring us to the Ontario website. So proof of COVID-19 vaccination, we're gonna scroll down and we're gonna click on download your vaccine certificate. So we'll left click on that and it'll prompt us to fill out these questions. So how many doses do we have? Probably two or more doses if we're looking to get vaccine proof. Do we get all our doses in Ontario? And which health card do you have? So for this example, we're going to use the green photo health card. And then do you identify as First Nations, Inuit, or Métis? And then we're gonna click on get results. Once we answer all of those questions, so we'll click on this blue box here. And then it's gonna tell us that we need our green photo health card and we need a modern web browser. So you cannot use uh, Internet Explorer 11 or earlier. Um, so we're in Chrome, so we'll be okay. So we'll press continue. And that will bring up this next page. So we're gonna scroll down past this information here. So we'll scroll down past all of this down to, to download your enhanced vaccine certificate. So we're gonna click on I confirm that I read, understood and accept. And then we're gonna click on this box, download your enhanced vaccine certificate. So we'll left click on that. And it'll put us in line if the website's a bit busy. It should take, as you can see, our late wait time here is less than a minute. So we'll just hang tight. It shouldn't take too long. This is just to minimize the traffic on the website so it doesn't crash or freeze. So there we're being redirected to the website. Didn't take very long at all. And so now we're gonna enter in our information. So the green health card number. So that number, I'll bring up the example here. We're gonna type it into that box there. That's the red here. So the one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, zero. That's gonna be that there. So we're gonna type that in. So for example, we're just gonna use that one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, zero. You don't have to type in dashes. It'll do that for you. So then the two letter version code, we'll see the example. That's the blue there. So those last two letters are the version code. So we're gonna click there. Let's just say it's AB for example. And that's there, so AB. And then the nine character code on the back of the health card. So on the back of your health card, that's the red there. Underneath the black strip there, we're gonna type in that code. It should be nine characters. So for example, we'll do AB. And for our numbers, we'll do one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And then we're gonna put in our date of birth. So let's say, for example, we were born in the year 1980. So we're gonna type in 1980. And then let's say we were born today. Let's say it's our birthday. So December 21st is today's date. So December is 12 and the day is the 21st. Then we're gonna type in our postal code. So we're currently in Bridge North. So I'm gonna use Bridge North Ontario's postal code. So K0L1HO. Um, and then we'll review this information and make sure it's correct before continuing. Then we'll click on continue there, left click. This will bring us to this page here. So we wanna click on the proof of vaccination. We'll click on continue. That's the yellow box there. Click on that. And then it'll bring us to this page here. And we wanna click on download your enhanced vaccine certificate. So that blue box there, we will click on that. And that'll bring us to our PDF of our QR code. So we can see for Jane Doe here, we have our birthday. Um, we have the two vaccines that we've received there. And then we also have our unique vaccine QR code. So here, it won't be a black box on your PDF. It will be a QR code unique to you. So we want to download this so that we're able to print it. So we're going to go to the download button. It's the little down arrow there with the line underneath it. We're going to click on that. And then we want to save it to a folder. So over here on the left, I'm going to click on this PC. And then to the right, we're gonna go to downloads and save it in our download folder. So we can double click on that. And then we're gonna go, it can save as a PDF file. Um, it may save as a different file, that's okay. We'll press on save. I already have a name, that's okay. So I'm just gonna press yes. Uh, and at the bottom, we can see that it's downloaded there. So perfect. And then we're just gonna close this window so we can go find it. So we'll press the minus button to minimize that. 
And then we're going to go to our document. So at the bottom left here on the Windows icon, we'll click on that. So left click. And then we want to go to documents. So we have this list here to the left. You can see a little page. When we hover over that, it brings open the document. So I'll move away. And we go over, hover over, it goes on documents. So we'll left click on that. And that'll bring up our documents page. So just below documents on the left there, we have downloads. And that's where we saved our vaccine code. So we're going to click on downloads. And right at the top there, it'll have your name. So for example, we use Jane Doe. So we're going to double click on that to open it. And that brings up this window here. So I'm going to maximize it here. This is our vaccine code. So we'll maximize it just so we can see it better. That's the square in the top right there. Close that. So this is our vaccine proof of vaccination. So we want to click on print in the top left there to print our proof of vaccination. So we'll left click there. And you want to make sure you have it hooked up to your printer so you can select your printer there. And we could press print here. Now, if you want to print it to a smaller size, if you don't want a whole page, so this shows right here where I'm highlighting, this shows how big it's going to be. So if we go to the left here and we click on custom scale, I can actually make it print smaller. So let's say 25%. So, and then we'll click away. So I typed in 25% there. I clicked on custom scale, type in 25. Uh, if I click away till fit, it fits the page. So it's the whole page. And then if I click back on custom scale there, it shrinks it down. So we can see now it's shrunken down quite a bit there. So maybe that's wallet size, I'm not quite sure. But it shrinks down the page quite a bit. And if you wanted to make that bigger again, we can type in 100%. And then click on fit again. And if you go back to custom scale, it'll make it full size again. So then you can press on print, so that's left click. And then that'll print off your proof of vaccination and you will have that to bring around to use as proof. So I hope that helped everyone. Thank you and good luck.